Uh, anything else? You want to end it there? I think we've, we've <laughs> okay. talked it. We go the boozy route, so we're talking about man on man <laughs> action right now. Oh my god! I don't. I don't know if you still care about that. I do. I do. Yeah. All right, guys. So for anybody who has been living under a rock, let me uncover. Um, let me open up the homophobic rock. Rock real quick. Little boozy, aka the Kappa song maker. Kappa song maker. Yeah, wipe me down. Um, Little Boozy recently rent well, recently went on a rant about Little Nas X. Um, so what happened was Little Nas X came out and was like, "Yeah, you know, me and Little Boozy got a song together, uh, blah blah blah." And I guess that was enough to set this nigga off. Mm-hmm. Not Little Nas X kissing some dude on TV. Not Little Nas X music video with mad niggas. Um, <laughs> but Little Nas X I got mad too, but. No, I'm saying little Nas, like uh, little Nas, X saying, "Yo, we got a song together was enough for little Boozy to go the deep end." And I'm not gonna say the whole thing. I'm just gonna give you the most important points. He all called slurs, him an f word. All slurs involving gay people. He yes, used. <laughs> put a hashtag on it. Hashtag. <laughs> he hashtagged it and then said, "You should die, or I hope you die, of something of that nature." Yeah. And I just can't believe he is that mad. So here's my thing. I think Boozy want fuck Lil Nas X. Think so? Yes. Mm-hmm. Cause why would you get that mad? That don't make no sense. Yeah, he might have touched uh touched on a nerve. His dick. <laughs> he touched be. his dick. That's like, exactly might be it. Hey man, we all been there. You see the dude, your dick poke up a little bit. That was boozy. I have not been there, but oh, you should. Yeah. But uh that was boozy. Okay. So I Yeah. I think you just wanna fuck him. Yeah, what, fuck him. at what point do you say what well, Does your enough? level of homophobia just make you like okay. yo, you secretly just want to suck a dick like that. That day, you just secretly, that. yeah, it's that. Like I want, like when you reach that level of homophobia, it's like, all right, bro, he's living in your head rent free, mm-hmm. twenty four hours, and everything he does is just getting you going. Yeah, you think after he um tweeted that he was finished, he's yeah. like, oh, I'm gonna suck his dick. <laughs> this yeah. gonna definitely get me to suck his dick tonight. I mean, this, this is a dude that bought a stripper for his like six son's fifteenth birthday or some shit to see if he was gay. And yeah. he was upset that he wasn't gay. I think he even paid her to fuck him. I don't even know. He, yeah, because he wanted to find out if his son was gay. Because if his son's gay, then he mm-hmm. can come out the closet as well. He's the guy. That, now I'm not trying to violate his son by all means. I'm just saying, like, same guy that violated Dwayne Wade's transgender son. He has a pattern of wanting to be daughter, gay. Or, uh, you're gay. Yeah, it's, uh, Boosie, you're gay. It's like anytime LGBT shit happens, it's like. Boozy's like, oh, I'm activated. Like, oh, yeah, I'm, active, I'm activated. <laughs> like, he's just, oh, yeah, shit. <laughs> Wonder Twin Powers activated. When something happens, it's like a slight against him. Oh, man. Pizza's here. All right, my bad, guys. Um, Someone's robbing us. But yeah, yeah nah. Yeah. yeah, move over more this way. Oh, but nah, yeah, it feels like that's just a way for um, Boosie to really express. You got to mm-hmm. keep moving to your right. Um, yeah, I feel like that's like that's Boosie's way of expressing, like, yo, I really want a dick in my mouth. Yeah, I think so. It's like, uh, like it's like he literally just has like uh, uh like a news feed of gay shit going yeah. on his phone. And he gets that notification. He's like, I gotta let the world know I'm, I'm not gay. gay. Wait, oh, you said I'm not gay. He's <laughs> like, I gotta let the world know I'm not gay. Like that's like when white people like to let people know they're not racist. Yeah. Black lives do matter. I mean, come on. Mm-hmm. So yeah. he just does it the opposite way with more hate. Like he's like, oh, like. Insert gay slur. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> you know, you gotta be smarter than that. He's like the Sean King, but for like anti gayness. <laughs> That's actually really good. He's like the opposite. Like he's just on Twitter, like, <laughs> we'll find who did this. <laughs> <laughs> we'll find who made you gay. <laughs> oh my God. He's just fucking uh, chip in his back. Oh my God. He's like, it was activated. Holy shit. I mean, listen, I wouldn't be surprised if 2021 ends with Boosie under Lil Nas X's bed. <laughs> you think, you think uh, Lil Nas X will be into it? I think he'll be into it for the clout. <laughs> I would say, <laughs> say the same thing. Like, just to be like, yo, like, I'll fuck this nigga yeah, crazy. I like, <laughs> Oh, no, I can see. Oh. Yeah, I, I can see him doing it just for the clicks and views. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> for the impressions. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yo, so my impressions went up a lot this week. But that's what, that might be the most, like, retweeted picture of all time. If he just has, like, a picture of him, like, was he knocked out and bed and him? No, nah, not even that. You know how, like, sometimes when girls catch niggas, like, eating pussy and they're like this, like. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> you got Boosie like this? I think Boosie's the top or bottom. 
Every bottom. Bottom. Right? <laughs> bottom. Devil your bottom. The way he been acting, acting like a bitch. Like, yeah. <laughs> devil your bottom. Because he, he been acting like that because he need that He need that get right. I you know how girls act a little kind of moody when they need some dick? That's Boosie. Acting hella moody because he needs some dick. Yeah. He just don't know how to really get niggas, so he acting out. Lil Nas X need to give him that get right. I just think it like it just really. I'm gonna the, tag Lil Nas X King thing is I'm, I'm just thinking about him being on the Sean King shit, but just like for, <laughs> for hating gay people. That's like <laughs> that's like Meek Mill trying to be an activist. Like. <laughs>